welcome back to I See Arts and Crafts. Today we've got our annoying brothers with us. My brother's name is Miles. My brother's name is Rose. And today we're making bouncy balls. Everybody bounce! Now let's get started. We're going to need some clear Elmer's glue. You can get it at the dollar store or any other craft store. And borax. And some warm water and spoons. And also bowls. How could we get bowls? Because we can't put it in our hands or that won't work. Okay, so we so. already put some warm water into our bowls. And then next we're going to need one and a half spoons or one tablespoon or two. Two uh, tablespoons of teaspoons of um, two teaspoons of borax. So we're going to put two in. Good. Maybe just a bit more because I got a little in the last one. Okay. Oh, next the borax. In. We should have said we should have we should have got everything. Okay. So now you can put your glue in. once like everything's dissolved in mixed. Now we can put here. Oh, I just gotta pull off. Okay. So I still have to put some more glue. Which I'm not done. But I did get a glob, which means I'm. I. It, that means it's good because that means we need. We, okay, that's enough glue. And then we're gonna. I only this. put in two. Oh, that's okay. We can put it in two or three. You should put it in three. And then mix it all. And then you have this stuff. It feels kind of like putty slime. You're going to need to roll it into a ball. Oh, wait. It's still a bit gooey. I'm going to have to mix it some more. The borax. If it's still a bit gooey, then you still have to mix it. And keep mixing it until it gets more just more like this and then you're gonna form it into a ball with your hands you have to get as it will be quite sticky very sticky yeah and also it's gonna get like gooey it isn't a, it, you're gonna shape it with your spoon if you want or you can shape it with something round or something like now we're rolling into a ball as round as we can and then we're gonna put it in the spoon to dry so because we don't want to put it on a flat surface because that means it's gonna the bottom's gonna be flat when it dries. So we need a round surface. Look, see it's still not round. It doesn't have to be exactly perfect, but try to get as best as you can. Okay, so now we're gonna leave it on the spoon. Uh we gotta take my spoon out. Put it right here. I'm just gonna round it up to make sure it's Good, and then... Zip, nice and round. Oh, wait, still more. Now, you're gonna leave it and let it dry in the spoon. So this is how they turned out. Watch the bounce. Yeah! Up in the air, oh, down on the ground. Oh, I need to crack oh. it at. Uh-oh, we didn't let them dry long enough. You guys have to let them dry for about one hour. No. We, we were too impatient and we wanted to finish up the video, but see, ours had a crack. Um, but so I hope you like this video and we'll see you next time and if you like the video hit the like button the bell and comment down below if you have any other ideas for us to do next bye bye